Keeping the city safe this summer was the goal of an outreach event on the east side this afternoon. It was the first of several planned for this month. WRTV's Kayla Molander shows us how the mayor and others worked to, to connect with residents. In order to really get somebody's attention, what's the best way? Take them to eat. Brandon Ballard is one of the peacemakers working to make connections and curb crime in Indianapolis. Since we can't take everybody to eat individually, we brought the food to the hood so we can feed the, feed the streets, as some people would say. Wednesday afternoon, Indianapolis Mayor Joe Hogsett kicked off the Summer Neighborhood Outreach Series. Every Wednesday in June, the Office of Public Health and Safety will bring a resource fair to one of the city's underserved communities. What our Office of Public Health and Safety is doing um, is what I consider to be crime prevention, crime avoidance, crime interruption. The fair had a barbecue, STD testing, and fresh vegetables, all for free. The mayor is hoping that events like these will make this summer less deadly than last. So this whole foundation that this administration is pushing is built on trust and hope. And so just because we don't have, you know, zero shootings doesn't mean it's not working, right? We're talking to the community, we're hearing them, and they know that we're here now. City leaders were happy with the strong turnout, and residents were happy to barbecue with the mayor. Building trust takes time, and this is just the beginning. This is a step towards that, you know, it's going to take consistency, I feel like, um, just not one event. But yes, it's great. It's great to come out here and see this and get some resources. I just thought it was a blessing that they're coming out to the community to, you know, bless people that, you know, might need food so they can be able to have to feed their families. Was your hot dog good? Mm-hmm. What, what do you think about the people here handing out hot dogs for free today? It's nice. <laughs> Working for you, Kayla Molander, WRTV.